current fifth grade students will follow in your footsteps very soon as they go to middle school at E.D. Walker and graduate from W.T. White High School in 2019. Wow, that's not very far away. But, but more importantly, you know, I want you to join me in, in congratulating Ms. Dash and the staff that she put together and, of course, the students of this great school. I want to thank all of you who were formerly on the city council, current city council member and mayor, uh, Todd Meyer, Joe, and everybody who made this possible. These di the precincts in Addison were actually in the 2008 bond, the precincts that most overwhelmingly voted in favor of passing the bond and actually had the highest percentages of voting in favor of the bond. So it was really the citizens of Addison that not only made this school possible, but many of our schools possible. So I really All of our students deserve facilities like this one. They truly do because it just brings a sense of pride and um, commitment and students learn to cherish not only our buildings and the staff but the legacies in our buildings of um, individuals just like President Bush who leave legacies of their own and also allow students an opportunity to create their own legacies and that is really what we're hoping for the students at this wonderful elementary school. And for those who don't know, I come from a family of eight. Yes, eight. Uh, as you heard Principal Dash say, my mother was a school teacher, and my father uh, was a trained chemical engineer, but he has been mowing lawns as a small business owner for as long as I can remember. And both of my parents taught me a tremendous deal about uh, hard work, and I'm looking at you kiddos, hard work and responsibility and uh, determination and they said Stephanie you can do anything you want if you put your heart and your mind into it. In the 80s DISD did a bond campaign long before the 2008 campaign and they developed a slogan that I think is still today appropriate to put everything in perspective and, the, and they posed the rhetorical question of what is a school and they answered it with it's four walls with a roof and the future inside. And today we can add, and with the inspirational name of George Herbert Walker Bush attached to it. We will be the strongest, brightest stars. We will be the source of light and the source of pride. We will be together side by side, but you gotta believe. But most importantly, education and family is what matters most to George H.W. Bush. Whether you talk about the Dallas Celebration of Reading, which has raised millions of dollars for literacy here in, in the Metroplex, or, or you talk about the Points of Light Foundation, which continues to encourage volunteerism through after-school programs or encouraging people to teach in inner-city high schools. This is what George H.W. Bush is all about. I'm George Herbert Walker Bush. And I am proud to have your school named in my honor. I join you in spirit today to celebrate your new school. For the students, I have just a little advice today. Read something for both fun and learning each day. Whether it's literature or textbooks or even comic books, reading leads to learning and readers are leaders. Next, give schoolwork the attention it deserves even with your least favorite subjects, a little more time can make the difference between success and failures. Always give your best effort. You might not get a perfect score, but you'll know you did your best. Parents and community members, your active participation as volunteers will create an ed educational team with the teachers that will guarantee your students success. Teachers and staff, thank you for all you do for our future leaders. You are our heroes. Go Patriots. That was awesome. Such thoughtful words of encouragement and guidance from our former president. It means a lot to have this message for our students and families for years to come. I'm sure we'll watch it often. Thank you, Mr. Bush, as well, for sharing in this very special day with us. Uh, the total project cost for the school is $22 million. 
I believe we've got about 600 students here now, but the school will hold up to 800 students in grades pre-K through five. It has 35 core curriculum classrooms, uh, and we've got specialty classrooms for science, music, art, technology, students with special needs, and so forth. It has not only a media center, but it has a gymnasium, multi-purpose performance hall like this, uh, and a cafeteria. That represents to you, the folks of Addison, almost $30 million investment from the school district. And join us in reciting the George H.W. Bush Elementary Learners Campus Creed. We, we the proud patriots, patriots of George H.W. Bush Elementary, will practice the lifelong guidelines of trustworthiness, appreciation, and personal best. We will also be respectful, responsible, caring, and safe. We will do all these things with one purpose in mind, to do our best and not waste this day, for this day will come no more. I can do anything and I can become anything because excellence begins with me.